the tasty one pot dinner with a twist. Forget everything you know about traditional tacos this morning. We're taking the family favorite. We're kicking it up a notch. Patty Hinich is the host of Patty's Mexican Table on PBS. Patty, nice to see you. So Did I say nice your last name correctly? You. It was perfect. Did I do it? Okay, good. These are not just any tacos, and I love tacos. You're making short rib tacos. Let's talk about the ingredients. Yes. Matt, I'm so happy to be cooking with you. Really, Me too. so excited. So I want to show you how to make a beast of a taco. All right. This is my favorite taco. You got short ribs. Short ribs. These are country style short ribs. So the bone has been taken out, full of flavor. Guacamole, then, mm -hmm. some pomegranate, mm -hmm. which is a secret ingredient for you. Some great mint, mm -hmm. onions, a little red, red wine. wine. All right, let's get started. You want to brown the short ribs. Yes, so we're going to add some salt and pepper. And the first thing we want to do is brown it. Um, we have the pan over medium high heat. And you want to get a really nice sear on both sides. Okay. So we're How doing long does that take generally? A few minutes on each side. It's really fast. And what you want to do here is really just make that nice crust. And you want to do everything you can to make this piece of meat be the best it can possibly be. And whatever be. ends up on the bottom of that pot, you're going to keep that and you're going to scrape it into everything else. Exactly. Okay. So we did what fancy cooks called the glazing, which is you have, you know, the brown bits and the fat, and then you add the onion and the garlic. It's going to transform the raw taste from the onion and the garlic to very rustic and sweet. And then we're going to add the meat. We're, oh, no. First, we're going to deglaze. Okay. Fancy term for just getting all of the flavor out of the pan. So if you don't want to use red wine, you can use chicken broth. All right, perfect. But um, what the pomegranate juice is going to do is help it caramelize when we put it in the oven. So here it goes. You want to see a great sight, Patty? Yes. Look what's happening downstairs. I brought in, oh. I brought in a, a ringer. Oh, Jim Gaffigan, Gaffigan in there as well. Uh-huh. Lights so up. Great. Okay. It's, it's a big bite, apparently. Phenomenal. Food in it, does it? Yeah, it does. All right, so after that has oh, cooked down a bit, it's going to look like this. So you Can't cover it and you put it in the oven. And it's going to cook there for like an hour and a half. So you're browning and then you're bracing. You're making it oh be luscious, succulent. You want just the meat to completely... See? Oh. Beautiful. So you take that meat. Okay. Bring it. And No, it's oh, right here okay. shredded. And then you just, you know, you can taco absolutely anything. But this is really a great combination of flavor because you have the pomegranate braised meat, and then we're going to marry the pomegranate juice that cooked in there and that caramelized the meat with the guacamole. So we're going to have an unconventional guacamole. We have some jalapeno, which will give it that nice Mexican kick, but we have shallots, which have that, you know, flavor that combines onion and garlic. Okay. And then we have ginger, and then we have lime juice and oil and some super ripe Mexican avocado. I have three in here. Mix all that up. Are these going to go in with it or on top of it, the pomegranate in seed? In and up and okay. everywhere. Okay, all right, so good. Let's say we've done that. We've Here's done what that. it looks like. Yes. You add a little cheese on top, mm -hmm. and you build yourself a taco. And Guys, how's it going? Jim, how is it? Jim's Jim's look, look, Jim, Jim, look, 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 it. Oh. That is the best oh, cat geez. meat I've ever eaten. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, I'm going to get short We're going to build one care. in a second. It's Patty, thank you cat. so much. Pop that right in there. My we appreciate pleasure. you being here. We're back after your local news. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.